Hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will see how to read the load lines on a cargo ship. So if you look at the diagram, if you look at this picture, in this picture, this is the actual load line of a ship which has been taken. Now, this particular ship has multiple load lines. So there is one load line here, two here, three here. Right now, the load line in use is this one. So this is the actual photo taken from a ship. This is how the load line looks like. W stands for winter load line. S stands for summer, T for tropical, F for freshwater, and this is tropical freshwater. LR stands for Lloyd's registered. So this is how the load line looks like and how do we read and how do we understand it. So for this, we have the di diagrammatic representation on the left side. Here the SD means summer draft, FWA means freshwater allowance, LR means Lloyd, Lloyd's register. In this picture and the actual load lines on the ship, the thickness of all the lines is 25 mm. So, okay, this is the, this LR means the registry of the ship. That is, this particular ship is Lloyd's register. So, if you look at the load lines for this ship, here is the summer load line, okay? So, the length of this line is 230 mm. In fact, the length of all these lines is 230 mm. And... This is 230 mm, this is 230 mm, this is 230 mm, 230 mm, 230, 230 mm. Similarly, this distance is 300 mm and the distance from L to R or if it is Indian registered, I to R is 450 mm. Distance from center, from this center till here is 540 mm. Okay, so this is the summer road line. Above this is the tropical load line. This is the freshwater load line. This is the winter load line and the winter North Atlantic load line. On this particular ship, it is not, this ship does not go to winter North Atlantic. Uh, this load line is not applicable to this ship. Okay. So the distance between the summer and the winter is one by 48 of the summer draft. Let's say if your summer draft is five meters, then to calculate the winter load line, you what you can do is, you can just divide it by 48 and then summer draft minus what you get is your winter draft. Similarly, the tropical draft will be summer draft plus 1 by 48 of summer draft. That is your tropical. Now, from the summer to the fresh water is your fresh water allowance. This is given in ship particulars that if you want to take the maximum draft the maximum load line to be immersed in fresh water you, that you can add that fresh water allowance to the summer draft you will get your fresh water similarly if you are in tropical waters tropical region and if you are in tropical fresh water then the tropical draft plus the fresh water allowance will give you tropical fresh water so these are the load lines this is how you read the load lines and uh, this will be very useful for uh, basically for second mates for appearing with the exams and uh, just to understand how load lines are read and how to make a load line diagram. Now this is the load line as seen on the starboard side. If you see on the port side, then this load lines will shift on the port side here and you can read it and this will shift here on the left side. Now here is the deck line. The length is 300 mm. Thickness is again 25 mm. All these load lines are 25 mm thickness. And all these lengths are 230 mm. And these gaps are like, this is summer draft, summer load line, plus one by 48 of summer draft will give you tropical, plus fresh water allowance will give you tropical fresh water, and summer draft plus fresh water allowance will give you fresh water load line. And summer draft, minus 1 by 48 of some draft will give you winter and from winter to winter north atlantic the gap is about 50 mm so in a very simple diagrammatic manner it has been explained how to read these load lines and how it is made now, thank you thank you for watching this video if you have any doubt related to this video 
please feel free to comment and I will try to reply as much as possible. And please do not forget to subscribe this channel. My channel is Master Mariner Amit Sangwal. Thank you. Thank you for watching the video. And uh, please don't forget to subscribe.